everyone. This is Yuki's English News Program. We're going to take a closer look at French presidential election today. 皆さんこんにちは。世界の人と話そう英語ニュースの時間です。今日は先日行われたフランスの大統領選挙について勉強していきます。今日のクイズは3問です。クエスチョン1。2人の大統領候補者のマクロンさんとルペンさんはそれぞれ EU に対してどんな考え方を持っていますか Question 2ルペンさんはナショナリストとよく言われます。では、マクロンさんの政治的立場は英語で何と呼ばれていますか Question 3大統領に当選したマクロンさんは元ビジネスマンですが、経済政策としてフランスの法人税を何パーセントから何パーセントに引き下げる予定ですかでは、ニュースを聞いてみましょう。In France, the presidential election was held on April 23rd and May 7th. Since no candidate won a majority in the first round, a runoff was held between the top two candidates, Emmanuel Macron and Marine Le Pen. As a result, 39 year old Macron won by 66% to 34% margin, and he has become the France's youngest head of state. 48 year old Le Pen is known as a nationalist. She is the head of Front National Party, whose policy is called far right populism. She had formally promised in her presidential campaign that if she should win the election, she would hold a referendum on France's EU membership within six months to withdraw France from EU, just as Britain did in 2016. Under her French first policy, she had repeatedly stated. The divide is no longer between the left and the right, but between the patriots and the globalists. On the other hand, Macron is known as a globalist. He is pro European Union. In 2009, he formed his own political movement called En Marche. In English, it means forward. He has described the En Marche, combines elements both of the left and the right. In 2014, He was appointed Minister of Economy, Industry, and Digital Affairs. Macron, who is a former businessman himself, says he will make France more business friendly and has promised to lower corporate taxes from 33% to 25%. Macron is also known for marrying his 64 year old high school teacher, Brigitte Tronu, who is 25 years older than Macron. いかがでしたか聞き取りはできましたかニュース本文とクイズの答えはメールマガジンで確認してくださいね。Thank you for listening.